we're asked to fill this cross number with single digits in each box and then what is the possible sum of the four digits okay now we just need to work our way systematically through this i think starting with the cubes because there's not many two digit cubes in fact there's only two because two cubed is eight three cubed is then 27 four cubed is 64 these are worth knowing by the way for math challenges such as this or just in general if you didn't know that then of course you just have to figure them out It'll take a bit longer 5 cubed is then 125. So these are the only options. So um, I'm going to just, uh, actually I'm going to just keep going for the moment. So squares, there could be lots of options for two digit squares, not so many for uh, primes. So maybe I just start by trying to stick 27 in, okay? that I think that's a good shout. Um, and then I want a prime number down because there could be lots of squares but prime numbers down so let me write down the prime numbers that start with 2 21 isn't 23 is okay 20 uh, i can just ignore any even numbers so 25's out 27's out it's 3 times 9 29 is okay as well so i've got two options here so maybe i stick in a 3 um and then i get a square number 36 that would work that's my only possible square there so when I sum the digits, I'm going to get 9 plus 9. I've got 18. So that is a possibility. It's not on my list, though. So I can I can kind of reject that one. Right, sticking with um, 27 here. We'll, we'll worry about 64 in a minute. Um, my only other option, remember, was uh, 9 here. But then I, there's no square number that well, that will work for. So I can just reject that solution. Okay, so my answer's got to be with the other cube number that I've not yet dealt with, 64. Okay, so now I've got to consider prime numbers that start with, uh, the two-digit prime numbers that start with a 6. So 61 is okay, 63 is 9. I can ignore the evens, like I said. 63 is 7 times 9, 65 ends in a 5, 67 is okay. 69 is actually divisible by 3. You have to be a bit careful with that one, but the... They just add to multiple three, so reject that one. Okay, so let's just look at 67. There's no square number that um, starts with a seven, so I'm actually not going to write that one down. It's got to be 61 if it's going to work, and then the only square number that starts, two digit square number that starts with a one is going to be 16. Okay, so then we add the digits 10 plus seven. The answer here is going to be 17. For the, you know, of interest, there are actually two options, 17 and 18, but 17 is the one that's on here.